Good afternoon, guys. It is May 6th, 2020. In this video here, I want to talk about um, an issue that I've had um, ever since we moved into this house uh, five years ago in 2015. Um, we have had a just endless amounts of lost mills in these um, electrical outlet uh, boxes right here. And so, um, they're supposed to be like an unused cover, and they have holes in the bottom where the cord comes out, you know, so you can close the cover over the cord. The problem I have with these is <clears throat> they just keep getting lost mess in them. And then you like risk getting stung opening this thing up to plug something in and then you can't even use the outlet. I mean, this is just pointless. So, um, People are now saying, oh, these are now code, you have to have these. I'm like, yeah, my only problem is these old style covers never had an issue. I've had these in nearly every other house I've lived in, and I've never had even the slightest issue. And so there's no holes for anything to get in, they're flush, they're sealed, nothing is ever getting in there. So, really this just causes an issue where you're probably, if you like just let it go and don't, you know, keep up on it, you're probably going to end up with wasps in your wall, you know, so it's really not worth it at all to me. And especially the fact that I don't even leave stuff just plugged in, you know, for long periods of time. It's just like, I just need power, you know, to run, you know, a weed whacker or a leaf blower or something like that, um, most of the time. So, these are really the better way to go. I had two of these on my house. Um... This one, which I haven't changed yet, which... This one I haven't opened up in a while, but I guarantee, darn guarantee, that there's a wasp nest in there. So, um... Yeah. The first issue is the other one actually broke off. Like, the screw wasn't holding the cover on, so it was just hanging on there. So, I just thought, well, it needs to be replaced anyway. So, I've, uh, I absolutely hate these in these covers. Do not like them. At all. So, because really, in the grand scheme of things, what's more dangerous? You know, I, I understand electricity is more dangerous, but I can guarantee you these black covers, I have never, ever had a single issue with them. Not once. And these... I guarantee you, you're more likely to get stung by a wasp than get electrocuted. You know, ten times more likely with these. So, in reality, these are just more inconvenient and more dangerous. It just, it's not pretty. I hate it. So, let me go around to the side of the house where I put the other one. We have three outlets, three exterior outlets on this house, and two of them have that um, box issue, and um, this is the one that broke up. So, as you can see, this is a bell lockable outlet. And you can get these at Home Depot for 
Uh, I think like just three fifty, three three dollars and fifty cents. I ain't that cheap. But they're metal and they're pretty well built. So um, as you can see, I mean, no holes whatsoever. You can see up in there. It's just when it closes. Let's see if I can get it. When it closes, it is flat. Nothing's getting in there. Uh, you can lock it if you want to. Um, so, really, these are just so much better, in my opinion. Like, a hundred times better. And they're more durable, really. I mean, the new in-use covers are just plastic, and they break off. I mean, these are metal. So, and, and I can pull on this, move it around, it's not going anywhere. So, really, in my opinion, because I mean, the in use covers are way more expensive like $10, $15, and stuff. And then you have the issue of getting wasp nests in there. It makes absolutely no sense to me. Why in the world would you want to pay 10 times more just to have wasp nests in your outlet? I wouldn't. I can guarantee you that. Um, we have another one in the front that is actually... Um, That one's been there the whole time, and that one is a flush cover that has never had an issue. So that one does not need to be replaced, that one doesn't have a problem. But these ones are the ones that I have a problem with. We would get wasps coming in and out of here. And, you know, if I'm mowing over here, I have wasps flying in and out of here. I can't have wasps in my walls. I mean, I don't know. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. I don't care what code says. I mean, if these were code back in the day and they did fine when they were closed, and if I don't use things that have to be plugged in for extended periods of time, then these are fine. These are more than adequate. So, yeah, this is just my opinion. I mean, go ahead and get these. I mean, they're going, I guarantee you they're gonna last you a lot longer, especially the metal ones like this. And, no wasp nests. None. I mean, I can't tell you how many wasp nests we've had in here. We cleaned out a wasp nest that was, you know, in there for a while. And then, like, not even 24 hours later, we come back out to replace this and put in this cover on. There was another wasp nest already being built. I mean, it's crazy, I'm, and I know you can spray and do whatever, but that only lasts so long. This is a permanent solution. You're not getting any wasps in here at all. So, yeah, that's just my one gripe with these new in-use outlet covers. They drive me insane, I will say that. They just drive me crazy because, you know, you constantly have to clean out wasp nests. And then you're at risk of getting stung. And you can only spray them so much. You know, 
Come on, really? Is it really worth it? So, I don't know. So, yeah. And we're kind of, you know, in the south. I'm in northern Kentucky. We're not like in the south, south. But, I've had more wasp issues at this house than I did at my old house. And so, I don't know. It's, it's crazy. So, Anyway, that was just a little rant and uh, opinion for you. Go with these flat covers. I am telling you, if you do not want wasps or bees in your outlets, use the flat covers. People, use the flat covers. I guarantee you that it's going to, because there is no holes for anything. So... Anyway, please like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos.